Unveiling the Mystery, Sing Your Swan Song. Hello, everyone, welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the fascinating world of the English language and unlock the secrets behind its idioms and phrases. Today, we're exploring a very poetic expression, Sing Your Swan Song. It's a phrase that carries deep meaning and history, and by the end of this video, you'll understand not just its definition, but also its origins and how to use it in conversation. So, let's get started and unravel the mystery together. To sing your swan song is a metaphorical phrase that means to perform a final act before retirement or death. It's often used to describe a person's last performance or effort, especially when it's seen as the culmination or the peak of their career. This phrase can be applied in various contexts, not just in the arts or entertainment, but also in sports, business, and personal achievements. The history of this phrase is as intriguing as its meaning. It originates from an ancient belief that swans, which are usually silent throughout their lives, sing a beautiful song just before they die. This idea can be traced back to ancient Greece and was popularized by the likes of Plato, Aristotle, and even Shakespeare in his play, The Merchant of Venice. The symbolism behind this is rich and poignant, suggesting a final burst of beauty or brilliance before the end. Now that we know what it means and where it comes from, let's see how to use Sing Your Swan Song in conversation. Here are a few examples. After 40 years in politics, the senator decided it was time to sing her swan song and announced she would not seek re-election. The athlete knew the championship game would be his chance to sing his swan song and end his career on a high note. The band announced their farewell tour, calling it their opportunity to sing their swan song to the fans who had supported them for decades. And there you have it, the meaning, origins, and use of the phrase, sing your swan song. It's a beautiful expression that reminds us of the impact and legacy we can leave behind in our final acts. We hope this video has been enlightening and that you'll feel confident using this phrase in your English conversations. Thank you for joining us today, and don't forget to subscribe for more insights into the English language. Until next time, keep exploring and expanding your linguistic horizons.